Hello everyone, welcome back to Cabin Vapors. I'm so glad you came back here to vape with me. Today I got an exciting video here for you guys. I'm going to be doing a tank comparison video on the MVP version 2. A little while ago somebody asked me what tank throws the most beast vapor off of the MVP version uh, style battery mods. So today that's what I will be doing. So today I am vaping on the pro tank here uh, on my MVP version 2. Now I'm also going to be comparing the iClear 30, iClear 30B, and also the iClear 30S. Now I have the iClear 16 upstairs, but I don't have a coil unit for the inside of that one, so that's basically going to be the same comparison as this one, but this is a double coil instead of the single coil on that, so please note that. But anyway, I'm going to be getting into that, but beforehand, I'd like to make a shout out again also to uh, you guys for subscribing and commenting. Um, just give me some ideas on what topics you'd like for me to do here. I'm kind of running a little bit dry on which topics to do, and thanks to a couple of you guys out there giving me some uh, requests and what to do. This is why I can do viewer request videos here, so I'll hopefully be getting more products then. I've been kind of slow here, and it's been snowy here, so I can't really get many stores and I don't live next to any vapor shops uh, here in Pennsylvania so I'm gonna try 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 to keep getting more stuff in but please bear with me here so yeah, it's a little difficult this time of year so let's get into the tanks the first tank I'm gonna be vaping on tonight is the pro tank 2 now all my e-liquids are VG based either 80% or higher so if you vape more of a, a PG based uh, just note that you're not gonna get as much vapor so I'm going to be rating all these tanks on vapor production, taste, flavor, and overall performance, and how I think of the tank with maintenance and all that good stuff also. So, let's give her a vape. Oof. Wick's got a little dry. Really good vapor production. Now, <coughs> sometimes on these coils, these 1.8 ohm coils, I do get a lot of dry hits on this. Now, note I am using a, a stronger PG, I mean VG based liquid in here, so that could be uh, half of the wicking problem. Now, I really like the vapor production. The flavor is good, but it's not the top. It meets par, but nothing more in my opinion. I really do like the flavor off of it, but there's other tanks that give me much stronger flavor than the Pro Tank version too. Now along with the uh, 30B there, the iClear 30B, this does leak a lot out of the bottom if you leave it upright. So please note that also. But overall in the performance, I do like it. It's not my favorite, but when this thing's working, it's 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 one of my favorites. I really like this tank, but it's I, I can't say it's my favorite. So, moving on from Kanger Tech, we're going to move next to one of the first of the series here of the iClears, which is the 30. I'm going to put this on. Now, I am vaping all this on 4.4 volts, so please note that also. And this is reading a 2.0 ohm coil head. All right, let's give her a vape. Oh, one thing I forgot to note. This is a single coil bottom fed tank. Sorry about not noting on that, but single coil bottom fed tank. Now all these are going to be slightly different. Now this is a top fed double coil and the and I clear 30. Give her another vape. Chuck's the vapor. I actually like the flavor off this better than the uh, Pro Tank 2. The flavor is definitely better in this, and you guys know I don't really like the top fed coils in this. So, But this does give really good flavor. I like the vapor production better off the Pro Tank 2. Kind of a compromise. This one doesn't seem to leak as much as the Pro Tank 2. It seems like the bottom feds always seem to leak more. This one does leak and gurgle a good bit. I'm not really a fan of that part. Um, but overall, I really like the performance of the iClear 30. Alright, next tank. Mm, that's the apple fritter in there. That's really good. 
We're gonna hit B. Come on out. I clear 30 yes. Now this is another double coil, and this has that chamber in there, that that uh, metal chamber. It is a top wick drawn also. But with this metal chamber, as I said in my um, my other review video for this tank, I really like the design of this. This is a really slick, really cool design, and for functionality, it's really superior than the 30, in my opinion. That is. So let's give her a vape. The best vapor production so far, as you could probably see from that one. And by far superior taste. This one doesn't leak on me, too. So, on those three notes, this is so far my favorite out of all three that I've tried. Now, I have the 30B up, but this is a heavy hitter. This is... One of my favorite. This is my favorite tank, in my opinion. I love the iClear 30s. I think the functionality of this tank is great. I think the design that Anokin put in this is fantastic. And shout out to them. This was a fantastic design by you guys. Give you a closer look of it here. So yeah, I really, really, really like this tank. I would suggest this to anybody that's you know from your beginning vapor to even more of your advanced vapors out there too. So I'm gonna switch this one off and uh, get to my last tank here. Now, I'm not going to do my rebuildable because that's unfair competition. I'm just going to be doing the clear misers. Now, like the Pro Tank 2 on the iClear 30B here, this is a double coil bottom fed. That's only a single coil, so note that also. Um, these both do fit 3 milliliters of juice. No, this fits 2.5 milliliters of juice in the Pro Tank 2. This fits 3. Um, as I said, a lot of you guys don't like this because of the leaking or gurgling problem. I hope I helped you guys in one of my last videos how to fix this. I know it's not really conventional to flip over your tank and uh, let the juice sit on the bottom since it is a bottom fed, but it seems to work that way. So, I mean, rather than let your juice sit in with your coils, might as well flip it over. You wouldn't do it with your iClear 30, uh, or with your iClear 30 because your coil's at the top and your juice is already sitting on the bottom. So, same method, maybe, you know, working with the gravity part. So, I do like that about that. So, besides all that, let's get down to vaping this. This does have really good flavor really good vapor production but with the strong VG based liquids in here after about four four or five puffs it starts to dry hit on me and you have to prime the hell out of it I'm not a big fan of that it seems like something with these coils now I do like this tank but you know I could go either way with it in my opinion you know I like it I would suggest this. I mean it, it's not my favorite so I mean out of all the tanks on that I just reviewed here, my favorite, in my opinion, is the iClear 30S. I think this is the best design, and overall maintenance, functionality, taste, flavor, vapor production, all the goods in this, this is the best. See, this never really gives me a leaking problem, it never gurgles, it never floods. The flavor always stays consistent, the vapor quality and vapor consistency always stays consistent. So, I mean... It's it's a fantastic tank in my eyes. Now, I hope this helped you guys. I hope uh, the one that you guys that actually suggested me to do this, this helped. This is by far my favorite on this setup too. I didn't get to the VTR now. With the same voltages, you're basically going to get the same thing out of it. So, I mean, this is my favorite tank that I own. So, let's give her a vape in celebration. Now some final notes. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe now because I'm going to be doing another giveaway here really soon. It might be a juice one, it might be a tank giveaway, I don't know, it just depends coming up here. So if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and please comment and talk to everyone else below. That really helps me out and then give me some topics that I can work with. So thank you guys so much for uh, joining me here to vape and uh, vape on.